This video is a follow-up from my lost folders video. If we can install dot settings files, why don't we just change them to DRFX before we install them, which is a really good idea because it's easy. So what I've got here is something I'm working on is a sports package. I only just started it for Formula One. I've got a folder and inside the folder I've got my PNG thumbnails. I've got my dot setting file and I've got two titles as such here. What I've done is I've put them inside a folder that's F1 because this folder will all be about Formula One and then we'll have other sports as well in this same folder. If I then come back up one more, I've then got a sports folder and I want this to appear inside DaVinci Resolve. Now I've actually got file menu tools installed so I can pack this into another folder and if I call that folder titles then I've now got a folder with titles, then sports, then F1 inside. I'm back to titles. If I then put this in a folder that is called edit and click OK, I now have a folder where I've got edit, titles, sport, F1. Come up to the edit and I use 7-zip. I'm going to come down to 7-zip and I'm going to add to archive and that will open up 7-zip. And then what I'm going to do is just give it a title. You don't need to worry about what you call it. For example, if you're going to add to it in the future, then you want to keep the name consistent. So I'm going to call it sports.drfx. And this is the important thing is to put drfx at the end. And then I'm going to click OK. And that is now going to create a sports drfx, which in effect is just a zipped folder. If I double click on this now, it will launch DaVinci Resolve. And now I'm just installing them like I'd install any other DRFX file. And then when I open this up and I come into my effects panel titles, I've now got this sports and then I've got the F1 here. So I can bring that to the timeline. I can play it. So I'm still building these at the moment. I've only just started these. So these might take a few months. Now I just want to show you if we go into Fusion, come up to the effect template edit titles we've got sports here we will go into sports or can come into f1 if you then right click and come to show folder this time it will show you the drfx so we're in the template folder of fusion so these are all my drfx files so that is how you convert dot setting files that are complete macros into a drfx and then you can just double click and it will install you don't need to create any folders unless you want to change it in the future because you can't change this without creating another drfx that's it thanks for watching i'll see you next time